You guys know how we've always heard switching to your sidearms faster than reloading. Call of Duty, the, uh, the game that shaped a nation of Second Amendment culture. Good, now switch to your sidearm again. You see how fast that was? Remember, switching to your pistol is always faster than reloading. Yeah, so um, I think it is, and it definitely is on the game. We're going to see today if I can reload the rifle as fast as I can switch to the pistol. I don't think so. We're going to find out. It's cold today. The temperature is negative one, basically at the corner of Nipley and Shriveled. So I'm going to be a little slower than when it's sunny and 75, but we'll see what we can do. Short little video. I'm just curious. Uh, we'll see what happens. Special thanks to TriStar Trading for some shirts they sent out. I'll put some links down in the description down below. If you guys want any of the gear that I use, optics, the lights, the rifle or the pistol, or my dot, I'll also throw some links down in the description for that down below. I'll do a one reload one with the rifle, show you the time on it, and then we'll do a one transition to pistol one. I'm sure it's probably going to be faster, but I'm, I am curious, so we'll see. Let's uh, let's get right into it. I'm double eared because this muzzle brake on this thing, it's, it's the uh, suppressor mount for my can. It is nasty, and it makes my ears ring really bad if I don't, if I don't double ear. So nice and safe. <clears throat> With the exception of the eyewear, y'all are gonna call me out on that, I'm sure. So, got one in, got an empty mag. Got a mag here with some more. All right, we'll, we'll do this from low ready and uh, see what happens. So one reload one with the rifle, stand by. Oops, I dropped my bolt. Four point five seven. That was garbage. I'll do that again without dropping my bolt. I've got a bad lever on this rifle, so with these fat gloves, I fat fingered it and, and uh, dropped my bolt and had to manually rack it. It would have been a little faster. All right, empty there. <clears throat> Let me get my me get my mag staged again. All right, one in, empty mag, some mags or uh, some in the mag over here. Do it again. Stand by. Yeah. 3.84. Not fast. I'm not real good with rifle, but that's not fast. Guys can do it faster. I think I can probably do it faster. Who knows? Hay bell over here, but I'm kind of aiming right in the dead center of it. So I am trying to aim. I'm not getting confirmed hits, obviously. But uh, let's do that again.
3.14. That was faster than my one reload one a minute ago. It must have been a little better on the, on the insertion. Of the reload. All right. Do that again. Let's do a two transition two. Either hard primers or light primer strike. Not really sure. Let's shoot that one again, see if we can get that one to go off. Or otherwise, I'll just chuck it in the woods. You guys, everything's harder with gloves on. Lots. Alright, the primer one. Or the light, the light hit one. It's in. Just curious. Alright, we got two in there. Let's do it. See if we can get a clean one. On fire! That was fun. That was a waste of ammo, but it was a whole lot of fun. Let's do a rifle runs dry, switch to the pistol, boom, boom, finish it off, and then get the rifle back up. I think the debate settled. The thing is, I don't think you can ever get fast enough with your reloads to beat this because if you're practicing both, you can get faster at this, no doubt. No doubt that I can get faster doing the reload and better and smoother. But as I practice, I'm also getting better at the draw. And so I don't think uh, I don't think I don't think it can be done, guys. What do you think? Let me know down in the comments down below. 
And uh, till next time, this is just a short little video. I wanted to come out and have some fun this morning before I had to head to work. Let me know what you guys think. I appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one.